haven't been on YouTube in like two weeks. I actually filmed a video um, talking about how I'm not gonna be doing competitions anymore. And I didn't post it because it was an eight minute video of me chatting. And honestly, I wanted to save you guys your time, wasting your time and just tell you straight up, right off the bat, it's just not for me anymore. I'm over it, I grew out of it. I took a very, very um, long, hard two weeks at one point after I left James and was looking for a new coach. I was just kind of like realizing that I enjoy just living my life and cutting for me and kind of like working out for me. I want to be able to say yes to more things. If you guys have been following my Instagram, um, you know that I have definitely been going out more, going to birthdays more. I'm at my friend's house right now. So welcome to this new phase of my life where I'm not a bikini competitor anymore, but more of a fitness model, fitness influencer. Still gonna eat healthy, still gonna show you guys what I eat in a day, but this time you can be more involved and you can kind of say, hey, can you throw a burger on your what I eat in a day or do this or do that? Like, can you do a vegetarian one? Um, can you do a workout that's like all like chest and triceps? Like, I can do whatever you want. So leave your comments and yeah. I had a half of an English muffin, just a regular like Dempster's English muffin with some natural peanut butter on it. And then I went to Starbucks after we went on a walk and I got this. This is um, not very healthy, but I'm addicted to them and I haven't really gotten, I never really get Starbucks anymore. So when I do, I just let myself get whatever um, and make it like my treat for the day. So this is a um, iced caramel macchiato. Okay, so it took me a minute to decide what I wanted for breakfast because I'm honestly, starving so I didn't really want to even make oatmeal so I'm just gonna have one of my Ado's bagels um these are actually really really good and I find them good too if you like if you're not somebody who can eat early in the morning because I do totally understand that this is kind of a good alternative because they're super thin but they're also very delicious I personally like having peanut butter on mine so I'm gonna use my salted um craft natural peanut butter but obviously you could use almond butter you could even put some avocado on here instead or if you wanted to do like a, one of those like sand salmon sandwiches or even put like two eggs with like cheese or something on it like whatever you want but yeah this is gonna be my carbs a bit of fat I'm gonna have um, the rest of my strawberries because I want to just get rid of these it's probably a hundred or 125 grams of strawberries that's kind of all I want I could do a scoop of protein powder but I actually didn't realize I didn't place my HD muscle order so I need to do that and then I'll have protein powder but yeah right now we're gonna do a protein less breakfast okay I'm ready to go grocery shopping my brightness is really high but I'm not gonna change it right this second um, outfit of the day, I have my Rider Wear cropped sweater. Um, they have these in so many different colors. You guys already know that. I've posted in these um, little cropped sweaters so many times. And then the shorts are from Maritzia. Just got my Joe Fresh flip flops on. Um, and what else? That's about it. Okay, I have about two minutes to say this until my car gets hot because I just turned my air conditioning off. Okay, so this what I eat in a day is definitely gonna be different than most of my what I eat in a days because most of my what I eat in a days I was focused on my bikini competition and how I wanted to look on stage. So whether I was in off season or on season, I was following a very strict, very similar, very repetitive meal plan. Um, you guys saw the same meals almost all of my what I eat in a days are the exact same for the last few years. So yeah, I wanted to kind of show you guys foods that you eat and you want to see and stuff like that I'm actually starving right now i'm not gonna lie so i literally might even go get food and then go home and cook i'm back turning off the air conditioning i'm gonna die um okay so you probably could guess i'm putting hand sanitizer on because i'm gonna eat my car because i'm starving i literally meant that um, yes i got freshy this is not typically how i'd want my what i eat in a day is to go like i'm not gonna like lie about what i'm eating throughout the day on the day that i'm filming my what i eat in a day um freshy is one of my favorite places to eat um i really like their tex-mex burrito and i add chicken uh, like i said earlier it's higher in calories so i'm just gonna be aware of that and not beat myself up out over that to be honest like i don't 
Like I don't want to like miss meals and be hungry later on because I had more calories right now kind of things. I'm gonna eat this. It's the Tex-Mex burrito at Freshie. There are other places you can um, obviously like go out to eat and it would be a little bit healthier, but um, I'm just like not really planning this what I eat in a day to be honest. I just wanted to show you guys. Um, I really like when people are honest in YouTube videos and just kind of show like what they would do. Um, I definitely want to be more aware of what I'm eating over the next few days. So today is kind of the last day where I'm like not going to be tracking my meals and probably tomorrow or the next day I'm going to sit down and actually figure out how much cardio I should be doing, how, what I should be eating, what my macros should look like and stuff like that. Um, but yeah, as for right now, I'm just going to eat because I'm fucking hungry and girls got to eat throughout the day. So I'm just showing you what my day looks like. Okay, this is my dinner. I'm really excited about this. I just want to remind you guys that I'm not like weighing anything or anything today just because um, I just like haven't had a chance to really make a proper meal plan to be honest the last few weeks. I've been on the go and like I honestly just couldn't bother so I've just been eating intuitively as much as possible. Um, this is a really bad example of that just because I haven't really been eating protein or anything today. Like I've been eating just not very much protein. I think I've had a lot of fats and carbs so I'm just going with the flow today um, and showing you guys what I'm eating throughout the day as my choices but again this isn't like a calorie focused or like macro focused meal plan um probably about 100 grams or maybe like 80 grams of sweet potatoes cooked those in the air fryer just like heated them up again one pickle cut up that's regular ketchup as i told you guys earlier um for my fries or whatever and then here's the burger um i think i already showed you guys the bun but it's just a chicken burger the bun i put a piece of Swiss cheese on there, um, which is obviously optional. I just had it in my fridge, so, so I figured I would throw it on. And then avocado, ketchup, and that, um, that sauce I was showing you guys earlier. So yeah, that is possibly my last meal, depending how I feel. It's eight o'clock right now, so um, I honestly might just like low-key take a weed gummy or use my weed pen, eat this, and go to bed, just depending um, how I feel. Um, okay, so that was so good i'm actually gonna have another one um i feel like that didn't fill me up at all and i'm super super hungry um probably because i actually went like six hours um in between actually like having the freshie and then having my dinner um so i'm just gonna have another one i'm not gonna do snacks i know i said i was gonna have a snack but all i really would have had is cut up apple um or like maybe even a tablespoon of peanut butter with that just to like dip it in but um i'm like really i'm literally so hungry right now so i'm just going to have another one of the burgers put some avocado on there and go to my car i got a new like weed pen so I'm gonna get very high tonight, to be honest. Like, what's new, but anyways. What else, what else? I think that, oh, there was one more thing I wanted to show you guys, one sec. I actually have a lot of like sugar-free drinks. Like this is the drink I'm gonna have tonight. One of my favorites, this is the one, um, I usually have one of these like, like not every day. I haven't had one for probably four or five days now. Uh, but I would probably say I have like four a week or like three a week. They are so good. Um, so I'm going to do that. Um, I do have like the orange bubblies or buble or whatever the heck you want to call it in my fridge as well. But I more save those for other people because I'm not really into them. And then I have that ice drink because I never really finished it. Um, anyways, I'm talking way too much. We're going to stop this right now. That's the rundown. In a couple days, once everything's smoothed over and I feel good, I'm going to make a meal plan, make a workout plan, cardio ideas um and all that kind of stuff and then i'll start making what i eat in a day that's actually calorie and macro based so thank you guys so much for watching if you like this video give it a thumbs up subscribe to my channel go to my tiktok go to my instagram go to, to youtube like wherever you guys want to go and follow me on those channels as well to support me and i'll see you guys in the next one bye